Hey guys, welcome back. This is week two, day two in week two. So today is my ninth day on the 30 day challenge. I'm in my bathroom because honestly, that's where I've been most of the day. I did the colon cleanse last night and prior to doing the colon cleanse, I had some curry chicken and I also had some roti skin, which is not healthy at all. And I knew I was going to pay for it today and I did. This morning I went three times. It started around, I wanna say 8.30 because I took the tea last night a little bit earlier. 8.30 this morning I went and then like an hour later I went and then I had to go out for an appointment at noon and I was so scared because I was like, what if I'm out and I have to use the washroom? I gotta find a toilet. But my stomach was growling and making noises, but I didn't go when I was out. It just felt very uncomfortable. I came home and literally at like 7.30 at night, I'm like, Trev, I need to use the washroom. We're bathing the kids. I had to run to the washroom. I feel as though if you eat clean though, or if you're eating healthy, that with the detox and taking the colon cleanse, I don't think that you would experience that much washroom visits, but if you eat poorly, then I feel as though your body is naturally trying to detox everything that you have eaten that is not good for you. And that's the reason why today I use the washroom more frequently than I generally ever do when I take the cleanse. So, Needless to say, this is where I've been most of the day, but I plan on getting my diet in tap and doing better. Today I ate a lot better. This morning I worked out too, so I've been working out. I worked out yesterday, I worked out today. I've been getting my workouts in, so now this week I'm going to be doing my workouts every morning, some cardio, doing some weight training sometimes in between the cardio sessions like if i do hit workouts and then i'm also going to be eating as clean as possible minus my meal last night and i'm also going to be taking the colon cleanse every second night and the skinny tea in the morning so tomorrow is a brand new day i will be doing the skinny tea in the morning no colon cleanse actually colon cleanse tomorrow because i'm not taking one tonight so i will update you guys tomorrow on how i'm feeling i haven't weighed in i think i'm going to weigh in at the end of this week so you guys can see if I've lost any weight or I can tell you if I feel like I've lost inches because inches so much aren't as easy to see as the scales measurement and I should have taken my inches at the beginning of this journey but I didn't so I will just kind of tell you if I'm fitting into clothes more comfortably I'll give you like a whole overview at the end of this week so I will be back either tomorrow or in a couple days just to let you know how it's going Good morning guys. Do not mind this crazy ass hair of mine I got going on. I am going to the hairdresser soon. That's the reason why I look so crazy. I wanted to come back and do a report on the detox that I've been doing. I haven't been vlogging the day to day like I was the first week. I've completed week two and though I am not going to go on the scale today and I'll tell you why in a second, I just wanted to come talk to you guys about the detox and give my true honest opinion so far. So I am heading away on vacation soon and because of that, I've been all over the place with like my eating and sometimes not even eating on time, sometimes eating horrible and I'm just gonna keep it 100% real with you guys. So I've also skipped a few nights of taking the detox tea just because I would have somewhere to go the next day and if you have somewhere to go I highly recommend that you actually don't take the detox because you will be running in people's washrooms at stores or you will be about to explode when you're out on the road. Did you see what I did there? So though I am still doing the detox and taking the tea in the morning I have not been taking the detox tea in the night. So I've been taking my skinny in the morning and failing to take my detox tea in the night several nights. Okay, so I just wanted to tell you guys that and that's the reason why I'm not going on the scale. However, I've been working out and I'm going to still show you guys my body because sometimes the number on the scale does not necessarily reflect inches and sometimes you lose inches so i'm going to show you guys front and back i am wearing just like a bra and underwear type set um 
but I want to see if I can notice a comparison in the pictures of the first week to the second week. So next week, I actually will not be here. And because I will not be here, I won't be able to really kind of drink my tea the way that I wanted to. This may be the final video in this series. However, I think that based on like the first video and then this video just showing my body, you can get an idea of if I've lost weight, if I've lost inches. So without further ado, let me show you my body. This is my side view now. So I still have my back fat, but if you guys can see and notice, my stomach is not as bulgy. Like I am definitely not as bloated as I was at the beginning of this challenge. I definitely have a lot more to go but I do feel like this tea has really, really contributed to my bloating, has really helped me detox those bad toxins in my body, and I'm really, really pleased with it. So if you guys are interested in checking out the tea, the detox, make sure to check below because there's always promo codes, and there's usually promo codes on special events too. So follow me on social media because there might be an additional promo code. Thank you guys so much for following me on this journey and watching me and listening to some gory details at times. I do appreciate the support and I will see you guys on my next video and maybe even next challenge. Look out too, soon I will be doing a what I eat a day in the life when I get back from vacation and also do some exercise videos as well to help people that are interested in losing weight. Stay blessed guys and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye. Saying 193.6. So you guys remember at the beginning of the challenge, I was 200. So I've lost about seven pounds in one week, which to me is awesome. I'll take it.